tight a start as I think we've seen all season. Look at that, five wide coming out of the box. And as they come down the hill, they're chasing Oscar Norm, and Norm just got passed by Jacob Yurt with Har in the mix. So Yurt getting it done early, gets that start. But look at Har right there. He's gonna make a pass here. Oh, here. Himself, himself into second. No, he doesn't. And Benham throwing the major block pass there to get by Anna Peterson as he's tucked in behind Emil Hart. Remember, there's still an overall to be decided here. And Benham is not the position he wants to be in right now. Remember, he, oh, look at this. LaBelle under attack. Francis Beltier trying to make a pass happen. Adam Peterson, he's got company yeah right the, I think the horn is honking a lot oh Peterson got all sorts of sideways and he goes over the berm with the sled he doesn't but he's got to go down after it wow talk about some action tonight so LaBelle that's gonna help him out right now oh an evil hard you're getting all sorts of evil down here on the uh he's break rhythm section and uh oh, Jacob no, here. Here. oh no trouble for the leader and that is gonna put Emo Har up in the number one spot. Oh no, and it looks like it might be some sort of mechanical. If it doesn't start right away, it usually it won't. Let's see what happened to our leader. This is coming through the Arctic Cat uphill into the core RV turn. Oh, okay, so he just catches that a little bit. No big deal. Gets back on, just can't seem to fire that Arctic Cat. Might have had a little bit of snow or something in his tether, so. Best Benham has been able to do is get to six, but oh no, he and Jacob Yerk apparently have it. No, I'm not sure if that's Yerk, but that is Benham. Bounce it down off the. Oh, that's a ski do. I'm yeah. not sure which one. That had to have been a big crash, though. Yeah, it may have been Marcus Ogemar's sled. Oh, it's Hunter Patnode. Oh, Hunter Patnode. There is Jordan LaBelle running in the second position, one minute plus one lap to go. But he's uh, almost 10 seconds back now of your champion, Emil Hahn. Final corner, final leg of the Anzoil Pro Triple Crown. Let the official celebration begin after a 14-year drought. Judnick Motorsports has an Anzoil Pro Champion officially, and Emil Hahn has another Anzoil Pro Triple Crown overall win.